Hey, Tony here. Today I'm going to show you all my pickups for the month of June, so stay tuned. So June was a very busy month. We had a lot of new releases, a lot of items that went on sale. I'm going to start off by showing you the items that I picked up for some um, 4K releases that I got. I got Jack Reacher, which I really enjoy this movie. Very happy to have that one on 4K. I got Snow White and the Huntsman. And then I've got the Huntsman um, Winter's War. I also picked up the Best Buy Exclusive Expendables 1, 2, and 3. And then there was a sale at Target. I picked up Creed 2. First Man. Bad Times at the El Royale. Green Book. Venom, Hacksaw Ridge, which I really enjoyed, 13 Hours, which was just a new release. It wasn't one that went on sale. Blade Runner 2049, Spider-Man Into the Spider-Verse, The Incredible Hulk, The House with, a, with Clock in Its Walls, so those are most of the ones that went on sale from Target about, I think, last week or maybe the week before. Okay, let me show you some of the um, Shout Factory items that I picked up. I got the Piranha Steelbook. And I also picked up Streets of Fire Steelbook. And then some other Shout Factory releases. I picked up the Power Ranger, um, the Mighty Morphin Power Ranger movie. Earthquake. The Entity, The Green Inferno, and Night of the Creeps. Okay, some other releases I picked up off of eBay. I picked up Double Impact, which I've been holding out for a good price on this one. Very happy to have this MVD release. And also I picked up Lionheart. Okay, some of the regular Blu-ray releases I picked up. Um, Suspect, the new Scooby-Doo movies, the Almost Complete Collection, the Star Trek Trilogy, this is the Kelvin Timeline with a poster. I picked up another release of the Godfather Trilogy, Leprechaun Returns, The Kid, Okay, off of eBay I picked up Rush. This is the Canadian slipcover edition. And I also picked up just the regular edition. I actually had a chance to watch this for the first time last week and really enjoyed it. I picked up Batman vs. the Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles. Unfortunately, we did not get a steelbook release for that. And then I picked up from Best Buy Walk the Line. Um, I needed this slipcover, so this was on sale for $5.99. I picked it up. And then The Haunting of Sharon Tate. And then from the Disney Movie Club, I picked up In Search of the Castaways. And 20,000 Leagues Under the Sea. Okay, from Mill Creek, I got this double feature for Stepmom and The Deep End of the Ocean. And then we have The Trigger Effect and Body Count. Mind Warp and Brain Scan. Mo Money and High School High. And then with the Retro 90s slipcover, I picked up Jury Duty, Double Team, Excess Baggage, and Opportunity Knox. Okay, some still books I got from the UK. I did finally receive my How to Train Your Dragon, um, the Hidden World 3D edition. It's the same still book as what we have here from Best Buy, but this has a 3D um, disc. And then also I received my lenticular cover for um, Black Panther, the still book. And then some other still book releases from Best Buy is the Us still book. Ghostbusters 1 and 2 double pack. Children of the Corn. 
And then from FYE, I got um, The Conjuring and Batman, the 1989 um, version. Okay, some other releases this month. I got Captain Marvel, the 4K release, plus the Steel Book from Best Buy, and also the Target Book Edition. And then we got Toy Story, 4K release, Toy Story 2, and Toy Story 3. Plus we got the Steelbook releases from Best Buy, Toy Story, Toy Story 2, and Toy Story 3. And just recently I got Dumbo 4K release, the Best Buy exclusive Steelbook, which is um, a very nice looking Steelbook, and then the Target exclusive Book Edition. And then we got Cinderella. This is the um, Signature Collection Anniversary Edition. And then we've got Cinderella 2 and 3, the Disney Movie Club exclusive. And then we have the Target Book Edition for Cinderella. And the Best Buy exclusive still book for Cinderella. And then with the release of Cinderella, they also re-released on 4K the Cinderella live action movie um, on still book from Best Buy. So those are my pickups for the month of June. Like I said, it was a very busy month, a very expensive month, a lot of still books. Um, we did just recently start getting the um, Criterion sale going on at Barnes & Noble. I did already pick some up on Saturday, but I'm just going to save those for the month of July. And I'm also going to just do a separate video of my Criterion collection. So just stay tuned for that one. But I really appreciate you taking the time to watch what I picked up in the month of June. Hopefully you were able to get a lot of these items. Please leave me a comment below. Let me know which of these you were able to pick up. Which of these that you hope to pick up soon. Um, let me know which of these might be your favorite. I really do enjoy reading your comments. So please, if you have time, please leave me a comment below. If you like what you saw here today, please give it a thumbs up and share the video. If you haven't subscribed to my channel, I'd really appreciate it if you would subscribe. If you do subscribe, please remember to hit that notification bell so that you can be notified every time I upload a new video. If you haven't found me on my social media accounts, I'm on Facebook, Twitter, and Instagram. So please find me there, and we will see you next time.